Have you seen him? Yoribo? His skin is all milky. Who is he? What does he want? Perhaps he drinks a lot of milk. He, he has no lips and he talks through his nose. Mama says that's how spirits talk. He talks to a man from Edo. Did you see his hat? Is he a missionary? Papa says he's from the government. He came with a lot of boxes. What's in them? He hides behind a box with legs that has got an eye. The elders say we must do as we are told. Stand still for him. Tell him our names. Obele says, run away if he comes. But if he catches you, don't look at the eye in the box. He's stealing our faces. He's stealing our souls. <laughs> Musi sang a song for him. The Oibo took her voice in another box with a wide mouth. Obele says he heard her sing again at night. But her voice, it was quiet and strange. It came from that box with the mouth. He measured uncle's head. I saw him do it. He wrote spells in a book. The man from Edo joked with uncle. They laughed. But uncle, he gave them the wrong name. I heard him. Ubuo the blacksmith sold Oibo some knives. He told father he charged him double, but the white man thought he was getting a bargain. He's stupid, this Oibo. Well, perhaps he's very clever, but I don't trust him, yeah? He's a trickster, like Egui the tortoise. Come on, let's go forget him. Let's go play. <laughs> <laughs>